What's up guys? So in this video, I'm going over most of the stuff I got knocked out within the first week of moving into my 2,500 square foot office and warehouse space for my company July Body. It's kind of all over the map, but hope you enjoy. All right, you guys, I'm about to get this wall painted. I haven't painted since probably like sixth grade art class, but we're here about to go Picasso on them. Got the whole setup. I'll show you guys what I'm working with. Bang. Just this wall's getting painted. And yeah, let's get right to it. Hopefully I don't fuck this up that bad, but I probably will. All right, you guys, it's the next day, but the first layer looks really good. Just need to touch up like the sides and the top of it. But yeah, super happy with how this actually turned out. I really like the color and TikTok did not lie. All right, so I got my window decal in today. And so my friends are gonna help me put that up, but here's what's looking like. It's two foot by two foot, it's gonna look really nice. I'll show you guys what that looks like once I actually put it up, as well as I got my gym flooring in today. Um, it was cheap, I got it on Amazon, and it, I'll show you guys what that looks like here in a second. All right, so I got the sign up. It looks good, turned out looking nice. Um, it was only like 35 bucks. The edges didn't really stick that well, but it's whatever, it looks looks nice so yeah happy with that turned out so i got my flooring in that i'm going to use for my office gym and i'm going to get started with it right now i'll keep you guys posting how it's looking all right you guys the gym flooring is in i'm actually super happy the way it looked and turned out as you can see there's a little opening right here i could have ordered another pack of these um to actually finish it right there i guess but it was like a hundred extra dollars and when the mirrors are going to be placed right here you're not going to be able to see it anyways so, and all the equipment's gonna be back here. And so when you go up to the mirror, you're not gonna be standing right here, lifting weights. I mean, you could, you would just look like a fool. I'm a fool, so I probably would do that. But yeah, happy the way this turned out. And I got my Wi-Fi set today. That was a pain in the ass. I had to go up to the attic to actually get it done. But we got taken care of. And yeah, where's this video going? Who knows, but it's going somewhere. All right, so the painting is now done. It looks nice. Um, I had to put a couple extra layers on some of these areas. As you can see, the top doesn't look the best, or I guess some parts of the sides I kind of messed up, but it really doesn't matter much. I mean, this isn't gonna be the shot, and yeah, turned out just fine for my standards. All right, so in my last video, I showed the shelving that the guy left, and I just put all that up in here, which is gonna be the fulfillment area, so starting to kind of get stuff organized a little bit. And he left pretty much the perfect amount I need because it fits pretty much all of my packing supplies. And once I need more, I'll be able to make more space. So that's not a big deal. As well as yesterday, I got one more thing all set up, which I'll show you guys. I got and assembled this, it's called like a gorilla cart, I think. Yes. So this is gonna help me take all of my, let's see, it's kind of just like a, a bougie wagon in a sense. But this is just gonna help me take all my orders from here and take it to the front where USPS is gonna pick it up. That way I don't have to do it by hand, especially when I have a lot of packages. This took me way too long to assemble, but we got it done. And it's nice, super nice. Can hold up to like 1,200 pounds worth of stuff, so I'm never gonna have issues with that. So got this up and that's nice. All right, so I got a couple of signs in that I'm gonna hang up on this wall. I don't have my desk yet, that got delayed, which which sucks. But um, yeah, I'm gonna hang these up. And I have like a smaller table that I'm gonna kind of station, as well as my chair to get an idea of where these signs should go. That way when my desk um, come in, I can, I'll already have this stuff hung up basically. But here are the signs we're working with. So I got a, July body neon sign, which is super cool. It wasn't that expensive. It was like 110 bucks, which is nice. And then I have a couple other ones coming in. I have this Georgia Tech one. You gotta respect the rambling wreck, am I right? But I have a couple other ones coming in, but I'm going to get these put up. And yeah, we'll see how, I don't know how this process is gonna work. There's a bunch of shit it came with, but we'll, we'll figure that out. All right, so here's what the neon sign actually looks like. I'm gonna need my friend's help to actually install it, because I do not have a drill on me and that's what it needs. It also has a remote so I can change and adjust the actual like light settings. So yeah, it looks sick. I'm happy with the way this looks. And it's gonna be, yeah, just right in the backdrop over here. And I have my inventory coming in in around two weeks. I have 10,000 units coming in, so I'm super excited for that and to get working again because I have like 100 pre-orders to fulfill. And with that being said, thank you guys for watching this week's video. Stay tuned because a lot more is coming and hit the like button if you want, sub if you dare. I'll see you guys next week. Peace.